We'll do this. Um, good morning, everybody. It's me as Miss Chris. I'm vlogging on my way to work. Figured this is as good a time as any. I know you guys have been getting a lot of yarn time. Um, there's going to be a lot more yarn time coming up, too, because um, headhuggers.org has graciously asked me if I would do all their crochet patterns as tutorials, so I will be doing that, so those patterns are going to be housed here. Don't give up, because I do have other information that I want to share. I just, with school and all that other fun stuff, I have not had a lot of time. I am in my next to the last semester of school, which is... I, for the people who have been with me for the last several years, um, 06, class of 06, woohoo! Um, for my early on subscribers, the people who have been with me all, this, all these years, five years, crazy. Um, but actually, you guys would remember when I was trying to make a decision if I would go to school, and then the decision when I was going back to school, and then when I graduated with my bachelor's, and then when I started back with my master's. Um, you guys remember that? That's kind of cool. Um, I've gone back and looked at some of those videos, and it's like, oh, that is pretty cool. The guy next to me is like, <laughs> um, but I know that you guys have just been with me for a while, so that's pretty cool. Um, what was I going with this? <laughs> um, Oh, well, I'm in my next to the last semester, so I have three classes this semester, so I am full-time. Uh, with, again, being a full-time employee and a full-time everything, it seems. Um, I'm doing pretty good. Um, I think I have all A's right now, so that's good. And then next semester, I only have two classes and an internship. I'm very excited. Ooh, I'm going to get in trouble by the police. Let's see if I get in trouble for vlogging and driving. Nope, didn't even bat an eye. Um, so I have a meeting today to talk about my internship because we have figured out a way, because I work in IT, but my degree is in public health, so I have to have an internship, because, the only way you can waive it is if you have public health experience, and I don't have that, I have 13 years of IT experience, so, um, they've done is they've finagled around where I can actually intern at my own job, but it'll be completely on my own. Um, getting the answers and presenting those and tying my answers back to public health policy. So that'll be interesting. I, I'm meeting with the business intelligence group guy today. Excuse me, I burped. Um, the kids are doing great. <gasps> DC made student of the month, which is a big deal. Um, the reason it's a big deal is because, you know, when you're in elementary school here, everybody's student of the week at some point, but with student of the month in middle school, they pick two kids per class. You have to be nominated by a teacher, and then they take three nominations, and then of those three, only two kids per class, are they make student of the month. Um, so there's only 12, so you're talking, not even 12 months, there's what, nine. So it's very, very limited on who can do it. And he was nominated by a couple of his teachers, and then um, he made student of the month. I am so proud of him. He has no idea how proud of the, I am of him. See, I can't even talk straight. Um, he's been making honor roll. He's made honor roll two of the three quarters that he's finished so far. Um, he had a little rough bit last quarter, and like in the last, not yeah, not the last, I guess it's quarter two. He had a little bit of a rough bit, and it, it kind of come back and got him right at the end of the quarter, so I feel kind of bad, but he's really trying hard, and I'm so proud of him. So you, too, should leave a comment about how proud you are of him, because I definitely am. Um, I'm now at work, so I'm going to go in. Um, I may pick up a little bit of footage at work today, but I don't know. So with that said, have a great day, everybody, and happy hooking. <laughs> I know not all my subscribers crochet, so I will talk at y'all later. Have a great day.